God justifies you by faith and faith alone and nothing else. Salvation is by faith alone in Christ alone. Period. God did all the work for our salvation. God became a man. He died on a cross for our sins. He rose from the dead. Jesus Christ, the Son of God. You trust in Him and God will save you. God will forgive you. God will grant you eternal life. You trust Christ as your Savior. This is the good news we're sharing today. The salvation is a free gift. You can't earn it. You don't deserve it. I don't deserve it. God just gives it to us when we believe and trust Jesus Christ as our Savior. When we believe that Jesus Christ died on the cross for our sins and rose from the dead. When you believe God's good news, the Bible says God justifies you. He saves you when you trust Christ as your Savior. We're just sharing that good news today. We're sharing the gospel message today. So, you know, the scripture says, He who believes on the Son has eternal life. But he who believes not in the Son of God shall not see life, but the wrath of God abides on him. That's what the scripture says. So we're just sharing that good news today. That's what we're sharing today, the, the, the gospel of grace, the message of grace, that Christ died for our sins. He was buried. He rose again the third day. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, and, and you will be saved. You will be saved. You have God's word on it. God promises eternal life. God, who cannot lie, promises you eternal life if you will believe and trust in his Son as your Savior. If you will believe that Jesus died for you and rose from the dead, you will be saved. That's what the scripture says. How you doing, brother? So we're just sharing that good news today. The Bible says, but to him that worketh not, he does no religious works, but, but, but believes on him who justifies the ungodly. His faith is credited as righteousness. That's what the scripture says. That's what the Bible says. It's all about Jesus Christ. It's all about God's Son. He died for you. He rose from the dead. He wants you in His kingdom. All you have to do to be saved is just believe. Just trust Christ as your Savior. Put all your faith in Jesus Christ as your God and Savior and you will be saved. Just trust in what He did on the cross for your salvation. And believe that God raised Him from the dead and, and you will be saved. We're just sharing that good news today. So, friend, you can know today. If you die today, it's either heaven or hell. You trust Jesus as your Savior, you will go to heaven. That's what the scripture says. You don't trust Jesus as your Savior, the Bible says you go to hell. So, you know, if you trust Christ as your Savior, you can know if you die today, you're going to heaven. You can have that assurance. You can have that blessed assurance of your salvation. If you trust Christ as your Savior, if you believe He died on a cross for you, then you can know if you die today, you'll go to heaven and not to hell. You can know this. That's what the scripture says. And this is the testimony. God has given us eternal life. And this life is in His Son. He who has the Son has life. That's what the Scripture says. So you can know that you have eternal life and that your sins are forgiven if you trust Jesus Christ as your Savior. If you, you believe that He died on the cross for you and rose from the dead. God bless, sir. You can know it. You can know to be absent from the body is to be present with the Lord if you trust Christ as your Savior. You can know this. You know, we're just walking around in this body of flesh right now. But the spiritual part of man, your soul, your spirit, the spiritual part of man lives inside this body of flesh in the physical part of man. You can know when you die and the spiritual part of you is separated from the physical part of you, you can know 
that you're going to heaven when you die if you trust Christ as your Savior. That's what the scripture says. So God wants you in his kingdom. He died for you. He loves his creation. He demonstrated his love for his creation. The supreme demonstration of God's love for his creation that, it, that as a man, God died on the cross for our sins. Jesus Christ, the Son of God. That's how much He loves us. So Christ died for our sins. He was buried. He rose again the third day. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and you will be saved.